hello friends so now we construct the binary tree when post order and in order is given okay uh, if post order is given it means post means last node comes in last we traverse left right and node in this order and if in order is given in means in between okay so left node and right okay now we construct the binary tree with the help of these two st uh, strategy or with the help of this concept so in in the similar manner in our previous video when pre order and in order is given so from pre order we find out what is the root node when uh, because in pre order the node come first so for uh, given sequence the node with the letter which come first it becomes a root node in the similar manner in the post order node comes in the last so by using the post node po post order we always find out the node and what is the left child and right child we find it out from the in order okay because node comes in between and left part of this is left child and right part of the node is the right child so he see here in the post order the last letter always becomes a root node so in this sequence a becomes the root node okay so a this a becomes a root node so if this in in order if a becomes a root node the left part of this node is a left becomes a left child and the right part of this node becomes a right child so the left part of the a like dbfe becomes the left child of a and the right part of the a becomes a right child of the a so we construct the tree simultaneously so a becomes a root node the left part is d b f e and the right child is g c l j h and k okay now for d b f e sequence in post order we find which no which symbol comes in the last so d b f e means in this whole sequence b comes in the last so b becomes a node and if b becomes a node we uh we can say that by uh, circling it we denote that is the root node so if b becomes a root node if or or a node the left part of the becomes a left child and the right part or whole right part becomes a right child so for dbfe if b is a node then d is becomes a left child and the right part the right side of the b that is fe becomes a right child now for fe sequence in the post order in for the fe sequence in the post order e comes in the last so e becomes a root node if e becomes a node if e becomes a node then the left part of this e is a left child so for that reason f becomes a left child okay so this is the left subtree of the root node a now we construct the right side of this a now see in the post order for the sequence d c l j h k uh means for this whole sequence c comes in the last so c becomes a node okay if c becomes a node then the left part for this c is becomes a left child and the right part of this c is the becomes a right child so if c becomes a node then g comes in the left part and the remaining sequence that uh, that is l j and h k comes in the right part now see for l j h k l j h k h come in the last so it becomes a node so if h becomes a node if h becomes a node then k becomes a right child of h and l j comes in the left part of h now for l j sequence for l j sequence j comes in the last so j if j comes the last then the left part of the j is becomes a left child like this so if in the this is how we construct the binary tree when the post order and in order is given i hope you understand this topic with the very in a i discuss it uh, in a very simple manner but still you have any query then you can ask any time thanks for watching